This is week nine of the England Hockey Men's Premier Division. I'm Simon Mason to talk you through all the goals from the weekend's matches. Second place Surbiton made the short trip to third place to Wimbledon. The first half was goalless until Ed Haller scored with two minutes to go until the break. Alex Williams equalised for the visitors in the 43rd minute. Reece Smith put the home side ahead once more. But Surbiton turned the game on its head with two late penalty corner strikes. First from Gareth Furlong. And then from Luke Taylor with just two minutes left on the clock. The University of Exeter raced into a two-goal lead inside seven minutes at home to Beeston. Jacob Payton and Lewis Wilcher both converted at penalty corners. In the second quarter, Lewis Ridge made it three. Before Billy Collins put the home side four goals ahead at another penalty corner. George Fletcher pulled one back for the visitors two minutes later. But the four goal advantage was restored through Seb Ansley just before half time. In the second half, Beeston mounted their comeback. First, Rohan Bui scored in the 42nd minute. Gareth Griffith scored in the 65th minute to set up a nervy last five. But Exeter hung on for all three points. James Tyndall scored from close range to give Old Georgians a 7th minute lead at home to Reading. That lead was doubled one minute later with Sam Ward deflecting home. Late on, Ward rounded off the scoring with his 21st goal of the season to give the league leaders all three points. Hampstead and Westminster recorded a comprehensive victory away at the University of Nottingham. Rupert Shipperley put them ahead in the fifth minute. Kai Kepler doubled the advantage six minutes later. The final goal of the first half was scored by Howell Jones to give the visitors a three goal lead at the break. Sam French got goals 4 and 5 for Hampstead. Jolly and Morgan's finishing off the scoring with 9 minutes to go. Brooklyn's Manchester University hosted East Grinstead in a crucial match at the foot of the table. The home side took an early lead but were pegged back in the 16th minute as EG equalised through Tom Croson. Simon Faulkner got what turned out to be the winner just before three quarter time. Thomas Russell and Phil Roper gave Holcomb a two-goal lead in the opening quarter away at Oxted. But the second quarter belonged to the home side as they levelled the scores thanks to goals from Matthew Barnett and Owen Williamson.
In the 44th minute, Nick Banderak put Holcomb ahead once more. Williamson got his second of the match six minutes later. The winner came in the 63rd minute for Oxted with Chris Webster scoring. OGs and Surbiton both remain unbeaten at the top of the table, with those two sides meeting next week. The battle for sixth place now appears to be between Oxted, Reading and Beeston, with those three sides separated by just one point. At the bottom, Brooklands are now adrift by six points.